Hello friends, when it comes to dividing large numbers by three digit numbers, obviously it will take a lot of time and uh, even if you are very good in uh, calculation and your speed is quite good, you are going to take at least say about uh, uh, 45 seconds or even more to divide such large numbers. Now here I have an example 7031985 divided by 823 and I am going to try and perform this division using an amazing method and uh, the preliminary video of this method I posted uh, day before yesterday and uh, you can see that video also and uh, you will find that uh, uh, on the cards uh, on the i button here and uh, uh, after that you can try more examples and uh, get to a speed which is uh, you know amazing when it comes to division. So let's see the method 7031985 and I have to divide this by 823 okay now the first thing is the divisor that is 823 so i need to write this uh, divisor with the first digit 8 and 23 uh, on top like this and uh, i'll separate it out by this vertical line and uh, then draw a horizontal line and then since i have written two digits here on the top the last two digits of the dividend will come on the right hand side of this vertical line here this is 85 as the last two digits these two digits and now i have 70319 in the middle 70319 so now let's see how we proceed and carry forward this division very easily now see 8 does not divide 7 so I have to consider two digits here. So eight, when it uh, uh, when you count the table of eight, eight eight is a sixty four gets me closer to seventy. So seventy minus sixty four. So eight eight is a sixty four. So this is the first digit here. Now eight eight is a sixty four means remainder here is six. So that six is written after seventy here and this makes this number as 73 this is the new dividend 63 but 63 is not to be divided directly now when it when this is a three digit number the first step is quite easy now the second step it involves a minor adjustment and we need to subtract something from this dividend 63 now what is to be subtracted that is the first digit on the top here 2 multiplied by the quotient digit here so 2 into 8 16 so i need to subtract 16 from this and this gives me 47 and now the dividend has to be taken as 47 and not 63 now 8 5 times 40 gets me closer to 47 so 5 comes here as the quotient digit and 8 5 is a 40 subtracted from this giving me the new digit 7 this is the remainder and 7 is to be written here and that gives me 71 as the new dividend and now 71 now again i need to subtract some, something and from here the process will involve subtracting two numbers rather than one number and what are those two numbers now this is something very very important and what are those two numbers which are to be subtracted see this is 23 and this is 85 so just cross multiply them and add this is 10 so subtract 10 and 8 3 is a 24 so subtract 24 so whatever when you have two digits here and two digits here then you cross multiply and add and that number is to be subtracted from the new dividend so 71 minus 30 4 this gives me 37 as the new dividend and in place of 71 i have to consider 37 now now 8 4 times is 32 so i write 4 here as the quotient digit and 8 4 the 32 is to be subtracted thereby giving me the new remainder digit as 5 and due to this 5 this 9 becomes 59 and now 59 is the new dividend and how do I tackle this now? Again, 23 is the 
digits uh, which are written here on the top and just now I used 85 here now in this step I will be using 54 so just cross multiply and subtract the 2 from this 59 this will be 8 and 15 so this is 23 and 59 minus 23 gives me 36 now 36 is the new dividend so 8 4 times 32 gets me closer to 36 so 8 4 is a 32 and 32 subtracted from 36 gives me 4 as the new digit here which is to be written here and the new dividend becomes 48 now let us continue this method now so 48 now but I cannot have 48 here I have to subtract again something from this and what is to be subtracted again 23 and now 85 54 already considered now consider 44 so again cross multiply so this will give me 8 and 12 so 8 and 12 is 20 so 48 minus 20 gives me 28 as the new dividend now 28 means 8 3 times is 24 it gets me closer to 28 so 28 minus 24 gives me the new digit here 4 and that 4 is to be written here which makes the new dividend as 45 now again 45 minus so again you need to subtract two digits from this so 23 and I considered 44 here now I have to consider 43 so just cross multiply again this is 6 and this is 12 so 12 and 6 18 and 18 gives me uh, the difference 27 and since I selected for uh, okay 27 means 8 3 is a 24 again 3 here and 24 gives me the new remainder digit that is 3 and now after this two digits I have already found out here so my answer has already obtained been obtained here so 7031985 divided by 823 is what is num number obtained in the center 8544 and number obtained after this vertical line is 33 so that comes after the decimal place so my answer is 8544.33 friends you can check this uh, solution using the calculator and I'm sure you are going to get the same answer. Friends, I know you must be thinking that the method is quite difficult, but the, there are no difficult steps involved here. Rather, if you start dividing 7031985 by 823, then the first step itself will be very difficult by traditional method. But here, you have to perform division by 8 and not by 823. Now, some uh, students may ask that I have terminated uh, the process here after getting two digits uh, after the decimal. So what you can do is if you want more digits after decimal here, just carry on putting zeros. That is next step will be 30 minus and uh, you need to again cross multiply that, uh, that this step will uh, be there always. So you can find the quotient to any number of digits after the decimal place using this method just by suffixing zeros and carrying on with the same method. Friends, I know little bit of calculation speed uh, is increased by this, but you know this method requires a lot of practice. It might seem quite interesting also, but without practice, there's nothing. So I'll give you one or two questions to try yourself and uh, you can try whether you are getting the correct answer for uh, this, these or uh, not or not. So uh, you can find the answer up to two decimal places or three decimal places as per your convenience. Uh, this is do it yourself questions. So first one is 328192 divided by 713 and the second one is 4, 5, 6, 8, 
218 divided by 460 okay i'll give you 2 462 so try to find out these two questions using this method try this and i'm sure you are going to find it interesting enough because we have got to the answer in a single step only all these what i have written is all mental maths steps which are not to be written exactly so friends if you like this video of division then uh, do share it with all your friends who are interested in quick calculations and do not forget to subscribe the channel and click the bell icon also for getting all the notifications of uh, future uploads simultaneously i must tell you that uh, channel memberships have been enabled on the channel and uh, you can prepare for banking railways and ntsc ctet exams ssc cgl exams all quantitative aptitude topics will be covered in those member special videos and a lot of uh, pdfs will be shared with the members uh, followed by some live sessions also so go for the uh, channel membership i'm sure you are going to find it useful and uh, instead of spending you know thousands of rupees uh, uh, going to private institutes you know you can uh, join this channel and uh, get everything at a very very nominal cost so friends uh, th that's all from from me uh, in this video i hope you find it useful thanks a lot for watching this